Hello people of YouTube. Today I'm going to be keeping it real. I've gotten some comments, kind of compliments from people on YouTube on my confidence and that they're too scared to make their own videos. And I just wanted to address that issue. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to say some things that I've never told anyone before. And these are things that I've never really been able to bring words to. And last night everything just came together and I wrote it all down for you guys. So, here it goes. So, here's the paper I scribbled down in the wee hours of the morning last night. And yesterday, Owl City's new album leaked. And if you know me, which you don't because no one really knows me that well, Owl City is like the conglomeration of me. And Ed Sheeran. I listen to those two guys more than anything else ever since I have first found them. Um, last night there was also this chance of a lifetime meteor shower. So I took my headphones and my blanket and I parked at the top of the hill at this bird refuge near my house. And the lyrics and the stars were in perfect synchronicity. And I haven't felt so moved in a long time. Yeah! And I came close to real tears for the first time in five years. There are things in my heart I've buried and hope to never remember again. Five years ago, my life was torn apart, and since then, I haven't really been able to feel feelings. I'm trying to get in touch with them again. I don't want to be afraid of pain anymore. All of these feelings we have as humans is so precious and beautiful, and we need to savor them while we're here. These five years have been a journey of self-liberation and empowerment. I've turned myself into my own art project. I've changed the way I think, the way I look, my hobbies and the people I do and I don't associate myself with. All for the sake of becoming something new and inspiring. Something entirely dissociated from my past. When life gave me lemons, I made sugar water. I'm still a creature of solitude, but it's no longer out of fear. I've suffered severe social anxiety most of my life, but I now feel comfortable being myself as a quiet and receptive person in social situations. I can't bother over analyzing myself anymore when all I have to do is be. But there are still wounds that time doesn't heal. I've forgiven people for doing all sorts of horrible things to me. But this is the one thing, the black hole that weighs heaviest on my heart. I need to forgive him so I can feel whole again. I'll never be naive enough to connect with someone as deeply as I did with him. But I should thank him for the profound gift he's given me. My message to YouTubers is, don't own your pain. That's what keeps you trapped from the ability to evolve. That pain isn't you. It was placed there from somewhere else. You can be as blissful or as victimized as you want to be. 
find a new way to express your being. And that's where you will find your confidence, even if it's just a little bit at first. I look forward to seeing some new fresh faces on YouTube. That is, if you accept my challenge. So, if you accept my challenge, please po post a video response. It can be about anything, and I would love to watch it. That's it for now. Goodbye, YouTube. Goodbye.